Yo, what is going on? Today we're going to be talking about just my initial impressions of the brand new Infinity Mice series of mouse pads. We have all of them here, the Vagabond, Speed, Control, and Hybrid. I just got these a couple hours ago, so my these are just my raw initial impressions just based on how they feel out of the box. So far, all of them feel very unique and different. They do feel like other mouse pads I've tried, but from each other, they all feel drastically different. The Vagabond right now is the smallest mouse pad. It does come in a 490 by 490 size. This one is 490 by 420. All of the mouse pads have a custom, what they call IPU base, which is just their version of Poron. It is a custom blend of Poron and whatever they're using to make it stick. It also put these designs on the bottom. The Vagabond is the only pad with an art design on it. Though all of the boxes for all the mouse pads do come with art on the boxes, which if you want to keep those, hang them up as wall art. That's what I do personally. I use all the cool design boxes as wall art because it just looks cool. But onto the mouse pads. So the Vagabond right now is the second slowest, I would say. It is a abrasive texture. I would compare it similarly to the Lethal Gaming Gear Venus or the Aqua Control 2. It has a very smooth but rough kind of a texture. The logo's in the bottom left corner, and it is printed into the mouse pad, which I do really appreciate. All of these mouse pads, except for the Vagabond, have a stitching under the surface, or that's what they claim to have. The Speed mouse pad, the stitching isn't under the surface. It, seem, it seems to be on par with the surface, so a surface level stitching. But the Hybrid and the Speed, no, the Hybrid and the Control have stitching under the surface which is really nice that's like a really nice touch for the price of these mouse pads these do go for 35 dollars and i believe they've released in about a month as long as they're true to pricing and these things stayed to the consistency level that they are these might be the greatest and the only mouse pads to buy on the market just for my initial impressions this custom pour on sticks like really well the stitching is very high quality from a day one perspective and then the three different speeds, the hybrid control and the speed, they are just all very like this speed one is so fast. Like it like it's actually uncontrollable. I don't know if I'm going to be able to main this mouse pad because this one is just the fastest one I've ever used coming from a cloth mouse pad. The control mouse pad has a lot like as you can see, it has a lot of control. Like it is very slow and sluggish, but it also feels like it feels similar to the Saturn Pro, just from my first impression. This feels really similar to the Saturn Pro with the uh, surface texture. It does feel a little bit softer, but it does feel very similar to the Saturn Pro. And then the hybrid feels almost one-to-one -to, -one to a Heian. Uh, from what I can see, it has the same X and Y differential, or the, or the same X and Y difference. So it's nothing too crazy, but... Yeah, I have very high hopes for these mouse pads. I will be having a review posted in a couple of months. I will be giving all these adequate amount of playtime through multiple different games. Apex, Overwatch, Valorant, just a bunch of different games and just get the most value I can out of the mouse pads. But yeah, no, that should be it. This, so far from initial impressions, these are really, really high quality mouse pads. Like I am actually very impressed with everything I've seen so far. But only time will tell if these hold up to the standard of what I consider a very premium product. That should be it. Hope you guys do enjoy the video. Go follow my Twitter. I'll put the link in the description. I'm making sure I put all these updates that you'll see about these mouse pads on the Twitter. Uh, just going to be posting a bunch of pictures of the stitching and everything so you guys can have everything you need posted there. But yeah, that should be it. Hope you guys did enjoy. Like the video if you did, and I will see you guys in the next one. Love has